energy bills soaring, what if you could live in an eco-friendly house that not only saves you money, but makes you money? Well, such a house has been developed. Wonder House, the net energy positive home, which could earn you up to £250 a year. Georgina Burnett is at the property this morning. Morning, Georgina. Morning. Good morning. Yes, I'm in very green East Sussex and I have to tell you I'm incredibly excited about this because I'm going to show you around this very modern looking eco home, which of course at the moment is at the forefront of everyone's minds with soaring energy bills. But you know what? This is no ordinary home because this is the first off the shelf eco home, energy positive home in fact, in the UK that could actually earn you money. So let me talk about some of the features out here. First of all, this cladding, uh, maintenance free, up to 95% uh, recycled materials, so that's uh, plastic bottles, wood fibre. It's also 100% recyclable. Now, the solar panels usually pretty ugly, but these ones are virtually invisible. They're embedded into the roof. They're only three millimetres thick. We'll talk more about that later on. Of course, there is an electric charging point for the vehicle around the side. Uh, but let's come and have a look around here beautiful day for sunning yourself on the veranda now inside it's very similar to kind of any modern build i've been in before feels very homely uh, but what makes this so special is that you have incredible insulation you've also got triple glazing look at the thickness of these here pretty heavy doors and you need that because you have got a lot of glass letting all this lovely sunlight in but you also have an air source heat pump now that gives you your hot water for consuming but also for heating the home but it also cools it down in the summertime as well so a beautiful home in itself but with all these features as well and does feel like I said feels quite homely still now enough from me because I'm going to talk to you uh, talk to Nico who created this so Nico um, tell me how much would this set me back hello Georgina uh, well, we have from uh, two bedroom models to eight bedroom uh, houses and this one is a four bedroom house with 166 square meter and uh, it will cost £340,000. So that's, you have to factor in the labour though, don't you, and the planning and the land on top of that as well? Well, no, the labour is included. It is only the land and the services that you might require like water and electricity that are on top of that. Everything else is included. So we talk about it being energy positive. What exactly does that mean? Well, um, energy positive means that net over the year, on the assumption that you have a four-person average UK household in an average UK weather pattern year, uh, it will make you more money or, than, uh, than, than, you, you, than you need. Basically, it produces more energy uh, than you consume. So how much money could you earn from this? <laughs> on that hypothetical theory, about £250. So um, if there was a power cut, how does it fare then as well? Well, one of the features that we have is a battery that can store 14.3 kilowatt that works in conjunction with uh, uh, our solar panels, our PV panels, um, which are only three millimeter thick and they are coming from Switzerland. Uh, they produce 12 kilowatt of solar power and that solar power can either go in the air source heat pump and uh, warm the water or it can uh, store the energy in the battery so that it can be used later or if both of those parts are already satisfied it can feed the energy back to the grid and that's where you get the feedback tariff and make the money. So how long could you go off grid for then? It depends a little bit how you live in that time but I would say two to three days comfortably if you don't use your tumble dryer all the time. Let's talk about some of these uh, eco features. So um, the solar panels, I'm blown away by this. Look at that. It's incredible. Tell me a bit about these because it's, it's unlike anything I've seen before where solar panels are concerned. Well, obviously, one of the things as an architect and designer was the, the, uh, the, the appearance. And solar panels are doing a very good job, but they normally are very ugly. So to find these PV photovoltaic films uh, was great. We integrate them in a standing seam metal roof and they're virtually invisible. So I've got a roof that needs doing. Is it possible for me to retrofit this? As long as you have either a metal roof or install a metal roof, because these uh, panels come with a self-adhesive. They are guaranteed for 25 years. And uh, so you need a metal roof, yes. So what about the other eco-friendly features here? Well, we have an air source seat pump that works in conjunction with uh, mechanical ventilation. And uh, those two features uh, create the hot water the heating and cooling in summer, so you've got comfort cooling as well. 
And that basically takes the air from outside and uses it to heat the home, is that well, right? Well, because you need to, to achieve a, 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 a performing, energy performing house, you need to have several factors. One, of course, is very good insulation, uh, but even equally important is uh, air tightness, and that's very difficult to achieve. And once you make a house very airtight, of course, you must make sure that 24 7 you get fresh air. In. And here, the this mechanical ventilation filters the air, so it's pollen-free and allergic-free, and the air inside the house actually is better than on the outside. So can anyone build one of these? Well, we have worked uh, hard for the last four years in uh, researching and developing uh, a product in form of a house, and uh, it has all the virtues of a product, which means you have certainty of outcome, you have certainty of cost, and you have certainty of performance. And so technically speaking, if I have the land, how long would it take to build one of these? Once you have your foundation in, it takes 10 working days for a team of four people to put uh, the superstructure together. That is the walls, the roof, uh, the internal uh, floors and uh, the windows. And then you have an, a watertight uh, uh, environment in which you can finish your house with a plumber, an electrician and so on. All in all, I would say after the 10 days of superstructure installation, maybe uh, another two and a half, three months. So in to total, maybe three to four months. Have you sold any? Yes, we have signed our first licenses uh, to uh, individuals and developers and it's very exciting because we haven't actually started marketing yet. That is something we start probably in April. And um, what do you feel? Is this the future? Of new builds? Well, I personally think it has to be. Uh, it's our responsibility, I think, for our ourselves, for our children and for future generations. Uh, we must uh, address the problem, the climate crisis that we have, the energy crisis. It's our duty, really. Thank you very much, Nico. Well, is it the future of new builds? I'm certainly incredibly excited by it and it seems to answer a lot of the questions we've had in the past about eco-builds. Thank you. Thank it's you very a much. Special house, isn't it? It's gorgeous. It is. You've just so got to find the land. Pay for I know. The land to I know. I know. I get that. But it's and a get good the planning permission. Step forward. Yeah. Isn't it? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. no, a massive step forward.